Hi everybody, welcome back to Bobble Pop Kids. Get ready for some sweet, sweet Beatos. And gee, I love, love, love Beatos. And today we have, ooh, look at this one, you guys. Looks like a candy machine. It is the Be Sweet Scoop and Mix Candy Stall, yes. Thanks, Rainbow Kate, for that introduction. That was little Rainbow Kate, my favorite, favorite Shoppies doll of all times. We have the Beatles Be Sweet Scoop and Mix candy stall. You guys are gonna love this. Would you look at this candy machine here? It looks like a jelly belly machine. So, so awesome. I'm a super huge fan of the Beatles. I love Beatles because there's no heat, no glue, and no mess. Just make, spray, and display. Let's give this box a little flipsy, see what we're gonna be making. I think we're actually gonna be making, oh, how cute little candies, little gumball machine. Amazing. Seriously, we're gonna be making candy shaped beetles? Ooh, make one that looks just like my headband. Uh -huh. Come on, Bubble Pop, what are you waiting for? Open this baby up, we have to make some! Alrighty, Rainbow, what do you guys say? We pop open this box, see all the accessories, and start making some sweet treat beetles. Let's do it. Oh, I forgot, and stay tuned because after we make the sweet, sweet beetles, we're gonna open some happy places. I got a special delivery box. <laughs> Oop, no time to waste. Let's open up this box and see what's in here. Ooh, these are the coolest accessories ever. So, looks like we get our little sweet treat studio. This kind of reminds me of the Orbeez studio with the little candy cake you make. And what is this? Ooh, this is some more. So many things in here. Woo! Are the Beatles. Oh, and they come in the cutest colors. They kind of look like candies. Oh. Whoa! She looks like a lot of pieces. We gotta put these together. Okay. <laughs> I'm a little nervous right now. Tons and tons of pieces, but I think I can get through it. What do you guys see? We look at these one at a time so we can start this. Woohoo! It's out of the box. Look at this thing. OMG. How cute. It even has little ice cream sprinkles. Whoa! Fresh out of the box. Here we go. It's a scoop and mix candy stall. Look how cute this is. It's so decorated with little sprinkles. And it is a bead dispenser that looks like a candy machine. If you look closely over here, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven different colored beads that are going to go in there. They are going to look like gumballs or jelly beans. So, so cute. Right here at the bottom sits the floor plate. This is a little piece we're going to pop the template in to make our beetles. Also get this purple piece here, it's super cute. This is the lollipop stand. I guess after we make our candies, there's these little hooks and we can display them right in there. Ooh, I was waiting to see these ones. These are the design templates. We get six of them. Look at the things we're gonna be making. Little candy, this looks like the top of a lollipop. Flip it around, oh, gumball machine. That looks like a cotton candy. Over here we get this rainbow candy cane. These just look like little colorful sweet treats. These are just the coolest little designs ever. Oh, look at this little girl, so amazing looking. Oh, you have to do this one. Look at this rainbow candy cane. It matches my outfit, it matches my name. Do it, do it. We also get this piece right here and this is just too adorable for words. Kind of looks like a mushroom, but it is a lollipop stand. It's got these little sticks. We're gonna make the lollies and pop them right in there for display. Oops, I think we get five of them. How could they think of something so cute like this? Whoop. Super important accessory is the spray bottle. We're gonna spray some water onto those little beads and they are magically gonna join together. We get the Beatles pen, here it is. This one is a little bit different with them with the other play sets because it's got like a little candy scooper at the end. Instead of that old bubble that used to be there, we're gonna scoop up the beads and make our little template. And for some added convenience, we get this little pen stand. It's gonna go right in there so we could stand upright and not spill the little beads. Oh, and finally, we get this little candy bag to display some more of the little candy Beatles. Such a cute touch. <laughs> Look at that little pink candy bag. <laughs> of course, we can't forget the Beatles. Here they are. Oh, they are the cutest little candy colors. We get hot pink, baby blue, we get black. Ooh, that could look like licorice. We get white, kind of like a creamy white, red, yellow, purple. We get this kind of peachy color and two connector beads. <laughs> Raylene and Rainbow, how did you get there? What are you doing here? We're trying to make some Beatles. 
So now that we know all the pieces and parts, we are ready to go. Step one, we gotta fill the candy machine. I'm gonna get every color beads and put them each in their own little compartment. Let's right here in the middle, put some purple, one of my favorite colors. Our machine is filled with candies. The only thing I don't like about this, I wish they gave us some more beads. It looks kind of empty, but I think it gave us just enough for what we're gonna make. So we have some blue, white, red, you can barely see it, purple, yellow, pink, and black. And when you wanna get those beads out, you get your little pen scooper here. Oh, it looks like a little candy shovel. You open the little bottom and, boop, they go right into the pen. So cool. Now that our candy machine is filled, the next step is to pick a template. So here is our little base. We have to pick one of the six different ones. Which should it be? Hmm. All those cute little lollipops. Let's do these first. Super simple. So here is the base. We are just going to pop this into the tray. I'm going to keep this side up just so we can see the picture. Clips right in here and flip it around. So many colors going on for these little lollipops. We need purple, pink, orange, pretty much every single color. Let's try this. It's finally time! I cannot wait for these beads! Time to take my little scoopy, get my purple beads, get them right here. Ooh. Ah! Couple more. Okay, and if you see, they line up right in the middle of the pen. Ooh, we're gonna need a lot more than that. <laughs> These do not come out of here so easy. Ooh, this keeps popping out. Ah! All right, I think we have enough. If you're new to the Beedo set, all you have to do is press this little button, boop, and it releases. You put it right onto the tray. Beetles are really flying everywhere. So I finished the first piece of the purple. It's gonna be a lolly. All I have to do is get the white center and I'm gonna finish these ones up. Let's just reach into my white fan of candy. Whoop, close that. Scoop them up. They don't scoop as easy as I thought they would. This little thing keeps breaking. Ah! That will make it work. And I think it's a little easier just to go in there with my fingers and pop them in. The scooper is not working for us too good. I think that's enough. Place those little white beads right in the center of the purple one. Our first one is done, gotta work on these two babies and then we're gonna fuse them with the water bottle. I'll take a few pink, I think it's easier to go with my little fingers and pop them in instead of scooping, that makes a huge mess. I don't like that. Just do them one by one. Couple more. Part of it's all finished, I need some white. Two lollipops down, one more to go. We got a purple and white, pink and white, and this one here looks like a rainbow swirly. Get some yellow. Yeah, 
got a little blue. A couple of those. One, two, three, and we need three red. Wow, Bubble Pop, good job. Those look like little mommies. So cute. And we did it. Our first little design tray is finished. We made three little lollies. These don't look like lollipops right now, but once I put them on these cute little sticks, they really will. I filled up my water sprayer and I'm gonna spray them about five or six times, holding this about 10 centimeters away. Let's do it. Gotta make sure all of the beads are covered in water. Whoop, a couple extra sprays. I think that's good. Ooh, I need to spread the directions. They see to let this dry for about 20 minutes. So our little candies are drying. What do you guys see? We open the happy places. Oh, I love these. They are super cute. They're like little petkin house creations. Here's the tile and the blind bag. First one up. Oh, it's super tiny. Yes, and it is a new one. Now, if I was to guess, I think this is a little bar of soap. Oh, it's got little bunny ears. And next one, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be like a soup dish. Must be from the bathing bunny. Oh, and it is. Look at this little soap dish. It fits right in. Boop. Third one is a loofah. <laughs> How precious this is. Looks like a little furry rabbit. A little purple loofah. Coming in from the bathing bunny happy places, we got soap dish. Oh, look at this little yellow soap dish. Soap. Look at this teeny weeny purple bar. Wish I had a soap like that. And I thought this was a loofah, but it's a sponge. Aww. Oh, look at this fluffy, wuffy purple spongy. It's so cute. I love happy places. So it's been about 20 minutes. I hope these little babies are dry. Let's try. I think an easy way is to just scoop them up with the paper. <gasps> look at that. Our little lollies. Here's a purple one. It's still a little wet, so I'm gonna put it off to the side to dry. Here's a pink and white one. Kind of looks like cotton candy. This is also a little bit wet, so I'm just gonna let it dry while we do another template. I had a little oopsie with this one, the rainbow lolly, so I had to redo it. Kind of fell apart. I don't think it was ready when I first took it off. So while we're waiting for that, I'm gonna pop in the gumball machine. took forever. We have our gumball machine. Gonna give it a little spritz. Let it dry. Ah, and I cannot get this pen to work today. I've used other Beto sets before and they worked really easy. I don't know, I'm having some issues. So instead, I'm just gonna, whoop, this got stuck here. <laughs> I am making a mess today. I'm just gonna do it with my fingers. I think that's the best option right now. So we can finish up our last little bead of the day and start putting those lollipop sticks on. Last step is to just get the white little beadies. I cannot believe I'm doing this with my hands. Such a mess. But it's gonna turn out cute. Gotta make the stick. Give it a spritz. And set these little sweet treats to the side. They need about 20 minutes. Be right back. So I tried putting one of the lollipops on the stick and look, it does not work. First of all, the stick is actually more narrow than the bead. So when you try to stick it in there, it just breaks apart. <gasps> Cannot believe it. All that work for nothing. But 
it's still kind of cute. I really wanted to put all these little lollies and put them on here, but I don't think that's gonna work, so we're going with the next option. We can just put them in this cute little candy bag. This kind of looks cute. It looks like some pink and white popcorn in there. Huh? Ooh, Bubble Pop, look over here. I stuck them in the candy stand. Oh, they look kind of cute there. They look like candies. Oh, little rainbow kids took these in the candy stand. Yeah, I guess they kind of do look like candies. This one came out the best. But these other ones, I don't know. <laughs> this was kind of a fail. I don't know what is going on with these beetles today. Ooh, and here's our little gumball machine. This one actually came out the best. Super, super cute. And here is the cotton candy. Hmm. Well, we'll give you an A for effort, although these kind of look weird. I still like them. Uh, hmm. Funniest looking cotton candy I've ever seen, huh? And there it is, guys. Our Vito Scoop and Mix candy stall. Was it a success? I don't think so, but it was super fun and crafty. I love the gumball machine. This one came out kind of cute. Looks like a lollipop, although we couldn't put them in these cute little lollipop sticks. It just didn't work. But we're gonna have so many more fun videos coming up on the show. This is Bubble Pop Kids. You can click this big red subscribe button here and subscribe to our channel. Have a great day, bye. Hi, this was totally a fail. Sorry about that, but we'll try better next time, huh?